Hello everyone, I'm Keenan 47 aka Wolfkeen, and we're back to the Mojave Wasteland of Fallout New Vegas. Just as a reminder, I'm playing this game in hardcore mode, which means I need to eat, drink, and sleep, ammo causes weight, and of course, allies can die. Last time we were playing Fallout New Vegas, we were doing some more work for the Kings, and of course, for uh, now we're working for the Garrett Twins as well, as a bounty hunter, basically just collecting caps and stuff like that. Now, unfortunately, um, it's late right now, so I'm going to head into Old Mormon Fort, and I'm going to get some sleep. Because, um, what I need to do, I need to get, I need to wait till morning. So, I need to wait till morning in order for me to, uh, continue what I need to do. Of course, I need to go see the king again to let him know about the job being completed. Alright, here's the next person I want to talk to. Howdy. So, who are you? I've been around a while. Currently working for the followers as a gun for hire. But it's getting rather dull. Aside from protecting them from the occasional thug looking to intercept supply shipments, there isn't much to do around here. The one researcher I liked who I could chat up about liquor got transferred. And the rest of the docs are pretty uptight about my kind of fun. What are you doing with the followers? I joined up looking for a decent paying job. Granted, the pay's all right, but they won't let me kick back and slog a brew at the end of the day. They're worried the filthy drunkies in detox seeing me drink will cause an immediate relapse. I say their rehab effort here is just a revolving door. I bet you've seen a lot of I bet you've seen a lot over the years. I've been around long enough to observe the patterns of human behavior. Physical and mental anguish are especially exciting to explore. That's a bit cryptic, Beatrix. Hey, who doesn't enjoy a little pinch and squeal every once in a while? Are you interested in working for the Garretts? They already have that pig McCaffrey working for them. Do they need another guard? This would be as an escort. Uh, I've escorted my share of idiot tourists around Freeside. Too much trouble for what it pays. When I say escort, I mean prostitute. I'm all boot knives and leather, friend. And a ghoul besides. What kind of weirdo wants what I've got? Turns out there are customers looking for someone just like you. Weirdos into bullwhips and necrosis, huh? <sighs> Doesn't sound half bad. What am I thinking? I'm no whore. And I ain't about to hand my ass over to some penny ante hustler like he owns me. One of the employee perks is a discount. Now you're talking. I suppose I could sleaze it up a bit for their customers if it means I have a non-stop supply of drink. Tell the Garrets I'm in. I'll make my way there shortly. Okay, so that's really all I needed to speak to her about. Yeah, I believe Julie Farkas is sleeping right now, so I have to, uh... I don't think I can use these beds. Oh, yes, I can. Okay. I'm gonna sleep for about 10 hours and get up at 8. So this way, I can, uh, talk to her. Hopefully the video doesn't go corrupt because of this darkness. I really hope it doesn't. I really hope not. Alright, we're back. Hello. There she is. I need to talk to her for a few. Welcome. I think I found someone who will be able to cover your supplies. That's phenomenal. Who did you find? The Garrett twins. They supply Freeside with drugs and liquor. From my point of view, they're just better organized pushers. Upgrading their stills would increase their supply of liquor and chems. How does that help Freeside? With a certain plus of supplies, you could use your caps and influence to expand. Good point. We wouldn't be paying anything for their supplies, just a portion of our food waste to make ethanol. We get food from nearby wasteland farmers in exchange for medical services, so we could put our caps back into helping Freeside. Tell the Garretts we'll keep their stills running if they provide us with supplies. Thank you for arranging this. You've been a godsend. Okay, there's another thing I need that's... Alright, um... Alright, I don't need to talk to her anymore. This is pretty much it. Okay, so Hello. now I gotta go back to the Garrett twins and basically let them know about um, Julie Farkas being willing to deal. Now I need to uh, recruit a sex bot. That is a little trickier than you would think. And before I go do that, 
I'm going to, uh... I'm going to, uh, head over here and basically, um, head back to the king. Now, there are three ways to get through the... Well, actually, yeah, there's only a few ways... There's three ways to get through the gate that leads you into Vegas. One, if you can pass a science check. Two, if you can, uh, if you can get a passport. Or three, if you can get 2,000 caps. I have close to 2,000 caps at the moment. I have over 2,000 caps at the moment. So I can do that. The thing is, though, is that with the king... You know what? I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going. With the king, you get... Th basically, after you finish this quest, you'll be, you'll be able to get a favor from him. You can either ask for money, you can ask to uh, join the kings, and up. Oh. This didn't last long. <laughs> oh my god, that is horrible. Alright, um, I'll take that and I guess I'll just take it all just so I could sell it later. Ah, I forgot I have the bloody mess perk with this character. I forgot I have it. Um, da, da, da. I'm gonna take all that with me so this way I could just sell it. Alright, this kid I want to talk to for one reason and one reason alone, and I think you all know why. Reach for the sky, mister. Can I buy that gun from you? This is the best gun in the whole galaxy. I paid a million caps for it, and it wasn't even brand new. Hmm. Damn it, if I had my barter up a little bit, I could probably get him to, uh, lower the price. I don't think I can come up with that kind of cash. Well, if you can get me most of it, I could give you a loan for the rest. Okay, so, let me see something. Do I have a speech book that increases my, uh, barter? If I have a speech- if I have a book in here that increases barter by ten, then maybe I- nope, I don't. Hello there. Son of a bitch. Alright, I'm gonna head to Mick and Ralph's right now. Because there's actually, um... Remember, um, this guy told me if I wanted to get a sex spot, I need to head to Mick and Ralph's. So, I'm gonna head to Mick and Ralph's real quick, and I'm going to, uh, basically, um, ask them about this sex spot. Alright, we gotta speak to this dude right here, Ralph. If you're looking for guns, talk to Mick. Otherwise, I've got a nice selection of general supplies. Would you happen to know where I could find a sex spot? <laughs> Are you some kind of machine fetishist or something? The Garrett's are looking to satisfy certain customers. <laughs> well, the only place I know of locally would be Cerulean Robotics. But that place has been overrun by vermin for years. If you want to check the place out, you can find it on the west side of Freeside. The entrance is on the back side of the building. Just watch out for thugs. The rats aren't the only vermin you need to worry about. Is there a hollow tape or anything I'll need for the sex spot? Well, I don't know of any, but if you give me a few days and some caps, I think I could probably make one on my terminal. Hmm. Ralph, I've been directing a lot of business your direction. Call it a favor? Alright. Come back in a couple days, and I should have it ready for you. All right, so now I can get the the hollow tape from him. Thanks for stopping in. All right, so I gotta wait a few days in order for me to get the hollow tape from him. Let's check what quest I still gotta do. Well, debt collector, um, I still need to collect money from Santiago and Grex, and I still need to, uh, and then I just need to return that all. As for this, I need to go back. To, I need to go back to the king. And for this, I need to get a sex spot. So there's still quite a few things I need to do. And I still need to do this, deliver the package to a man at a designated location. So there's still quite a bit of work I need to do here in Freeside. I know a lot of people are about to say, This is boring! You're not getting in any fights! Da -da 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 -da. I know it's boring. I know. It's just I'm trying to earn as much money as possible considering my situation. I mean, yes, I have a bit of caps, but not really a lot to be in a situated yep. area. Oh, hello. Hey, you're the one who's been going around helping people around here, right? The king says to keep up the good work. He said to give you this. Alright, I got 50 bottle caps. That's nice of him. Yeah, basically, depending on your reputation in Freeside, you will get people like this to come to you, and they will give you caps. 
Alright, the first person I need to go talk to is Grex. And he's over here. Hey, man. Can you spare a few caps? Collect the money to pay back the Garretts? Whoa. Yeah. I guess the Garretts sent you after me. Look, I've got the caps right here. Just don't hurt me. You don't cheat the Garretts and walk away. Cough up the rest or you're rat bait. Okay. Here. That's everything I've got except the clothes on my back. I'm sorry about this. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. That's bad of me. That'll do. Mess with the Garrets again and you're dead. I won't. Thanks for not killing me. See, if you did that speech challenge, you actually take away his clothes and, um, you get negative karma. But I'm not gonna do that. I really don't feel like doing it. Alright, so now I need to go speak to Santiago, who is over here. Nah, but not a lot's going on these days, guys. I mean... I'm pretty sure you all saw this video about me getting ready to play Kane and Lynch 2. Yes, I am going to play Kane and Lynch 2. Also, there's been a couple of other things I've been working on, which I'll probably do a video on that later. Can I make anything? Uh, I can make Gecko Steak. That would be good. Alright, there's Santiago. How are you today? Santiago is fabulous. Now, here's the thing, guys. If you, uh, you can also get Santiago to work for the Garrets instead of old Ben. It depends on you. You owe the Garrets a bunch of caps. Santiago does not owe anyone. Santiago is a freeside VIP. Oh, yeah. For, I didn't exhaust your speech pattern on this, so I'm gonna have to go through this. VIP? The Garrets said nothing about VIP status. Yes, indeed. Santiago is very important. I even have a discount in Mick and Rouse. Perhaps you could use Santiago's discount. For 50 caps, Santiago will tell you the super secret code word to get a discount with Mick. I can't do this barter challenge. God damn it. 50 caps is a bit steep, but okay, here. Now, what is it? I did just Santiago get- Santiago thanks you. Tell Mick Santiago sent you, and the code word is extravaganza. Now you need to settle that debt with the Garrets. Sir, Santiago told you. Santiago has no debts. I'd rather not kill you, but Francine put a, a bounty on your head. I didn't think she was upset enough to have me killed. Here are the capsule. I do the Santiago act to get out of paying for services every once in a while. I didn't think it could possibly get me killed. Bye. Alright, so there we go. Oh, it looks like I got my 50 caps back as well. Oh yeah, didn't I do this when I first arrived here? Like, I didn't do this when I first arrived here? Weird. I guess I really didn't. Unless I did it in a video. And it just reset it. Check it out. Between the dumpsters there. Friend of yours? Nah, just some idiot that wandered down the wrong alley. Sound familiar? Hey. All right. Oh, he's got brass knuckles. Damn, there goes his head. <laughs> Get him, Boone. Oh, and there goes the guy's leg. Damn, Boone fucked him up. Alright, I'm gonna take all this crap just because. Ooh, bandana. Besides, you can um, repair most of this clothing together and sell it. Which is what I forgot to do. I forgot to, you know, head over and sell this crap. I'll probably do that off camera, so this way yeah, I don't have to deal with that detail. Over encumbered, I'm gonna repair the Badlands armor. And that's really about it. That's all I can really repair. Alright then, so that is done, so now we can head back to, uh, now we can head back to Francine so we can get our money for the job. Remember, um, we're supposed to get 50-50, so, I think we're supposed to get about 300 caps, so let me see what I've got. I've got 900, so that means, um, I'll have 2600 when we're done, which means I can enter Vegas, which is good. I can pass the, uh, the credit check for Vegas. The other thing is that we need to get that sex spot. 
As a matter of fact, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to continue with this quest. I'm going to stop prolonging it, and I'm going to head off to the Gunrunners area so I can hurry up and go do that. That way, I can go back and pretty much do everything I have to. Talk to the king, talk to Francine, do it all. So, let's see where it goes from here. Like I said, I gotta go talk to the king, I gotta go talk to, you know, like, I'm gonna do this now, so this way, I could just do it all at once. And yes, I'm repeating myself, I'm sorry, I have a habit of doing that. Alright, please tell me the game just did not freeze on me. Okay, good. Alright, so we gotta head this way. I kind of forgot, am I vilified by anyone yet? I kind of forgot if I'm vilified. Um, yeah I am by Powder Gangers, but that's really about it. No one else is vilified with me. That's kind of shocking because at this point I probably would have been vilified with Caesar's Legion. And considering that this is a, uh, oh yeah, I finally decided on the ending, guys. I'm gonna do the Mr. House ending. I haven't done that ending yet for, uh, for my playthrough. I haven't done the Mr. House ending yet. Now, the thing is, is that when I do beat the game, um, I'm gonna ask you guys if you want me to do the DLC. But the thing is, is that the DLC are a little long at times. So, I'm gonna let Yah decide if y'all really want me to do the DLC or no. So, it's up to Yah. Isaac's house? Why would the meeting point be Isaac's house? Whatever. I'm gonna get in trouble for being in here, but we'll see what happens. Why would it make me go through Isaac's house like that? What the fuck, game? Like, what? It just made me go through uh, Isaac's house. I don't get it. Oh my god, it made me go through Isaac's house just to go all the way out here. <laughs> oh, the marker system in this game, I swear to god. Nah, but I've already said this multiple times. Rad Scorpion. Great. Nice, I've gained Bug Stomper level 1. Now, I know what a couple of y'all are thinking. What is that? Um, here it is. Pulling the legs off ants suits you well. You gain a damage bonus against insects. So now I'll do more damage against insect-based enemies. All clear. Yep, so far so good. Nice, scorpion glands. I could sell those. Where's that other scorpion I killed? There it is. Reload. There's the guy. Oh, banana yucca. I could use that. Let me check my uh, let me check my stats real quick. Um, oh, I'm hella thirsty and hungry. All right, so um, I'm gonna eat a gecko steak. There we go. And I'm gonna drink a dirty. I'm gonna drink a dirty water. Is that good enough for me? Uh, I'm still thirsty. I'm still thirsty. I'm gonna drink another dirty water. There we go. Are you the Van Graff's emissary? I am. Do you have what we requested? It's right here. Huh. Then our business is concluded. Tell your superiors that we will contact them shortly. Okay. Deliver the package to the man at a designated location. Alright, so now I need to report back to Gloria. That's why I said I wanted to do all this now, so this way I don't have to deal with it later, because now I could just head back and... Now I could just head back and pretty much kill two birds with one stone, basically, and start completing all these quests. So we'll get... So pretty much now things should get, uh... 
a little bit uh, more interesting because I'll pretty much be done doing work in Freeside. I mean, there's still the one with the there's still the work I have to do for the sex bot, which um, I'll probably do that one as soon as possible. But I'm probably gonna give that a few days since I don't want to sleep for two days straight just to get the quest going. But uh, I don't want to sleep for just two days straight just to get the quest going because I don't want to waste supplies. So we're going to head in. Also, the cool thing, like I said, is that since we're friends with the Van Graffs, I can head in and grab and uh, buy whatever I want without my gear being taken away. That's going to be good for me because I need to basically get some uh, energy weapons pretty soon. I think off camera I'm going to spend some time getting some energy weapons. So this way you don't have to suffer through me doing that let me put that away of course we've got another hey, guy right here know. 12 more bottle caps sweet none of my stuff is hotkeyed is it nope none of my equipment is hotkeyed again i'll probably go off camera like after i'm done with this i'll probably go off camera and um i'll go ahead and uh start selling some things Okay, so the first place we need to go to is the Van yep. Graffs to let them know that the job is done. Ash pile. Oh yeah, giant rat meat. There we go. I don't know, I don't remember, but I think you can have free water here now, now that I helped uh, the addicts out. Hey, you helped out Bill Ronte, so the followers worked out a deal for you to drink free. Okay, so now I can uh, drink free here. So this will be good, because now I can... There we go. My uh, thirst should be good now. Yep, everything is good now. Except radiation, which is a little high. Um, do I have a rat away? Uh, yes, I do. I'm going to take a rat away so this way I can get rid of some of that. Alright, so now I can go to that water tap for free and I don't have to worry about um, getting in trouble. Alright, so now we need to head to... Uh, we need to head to the Van Graffs. We need to head to the Van Graffs. We need to head to the Garrets. We need to head to the Kings. We got a lot to do before I do before anything. So, well, like I said, the good thing is that I'm not vilified by anyone. So I could probably do this quest with Rex as well. Hey, buddy. Welcome to the Silver Rush. New I just Vegas love that. Is best. Ah, I'm just kidding. Go on in. Yeah, he tried to make it out that he forgot you. I kind of like that. Like, he pretty much knows who you are now. Alright, so now let's go speak to Gloria and let her know that the job is completed. Okay. Gloria! Welcome back. Did you have news for me? Or are you just here for the guns? I delivered the package as requested. And? Don't leave me in suspense. What was their reaction? He said you'd hear from them soon. Good. Good. Here's your payment. If you'll excuse me, I have some thinking to do. Oh. Jean-Baptiste was talking about a matter earlier that he needs help with. I volunteered you. See him for the details. Alright, so let's talk to this guy. Hello. Ah, just the person I was looking for. Your name came up in a discussion we had recently. My sister is very impressed with you so far, but I'm not. I don't think you have what it takes to work for this family. Luckily for you, I'm going to give you a chance to prove me wrong. What do you say? Want to make some real money? What would you have me do? No, no, no. That's not how it works. You don't get to weigh the options. You're either in or you're out. I'm in. All right, then. If we're going to work together, there's only one thing you need to know about me. I like things simple. Recently, Gloria negotiated a deal between us and a big-time player. We're talking more caps than you've probably seen in a lifetime. Your part in this is simple. To finalize this deal, I need to tie up a loose end. To do that, there's a girl I need you to find. Who is this girl? Her name is Rose of Sharon Cassidy. That's some fancy shit, right? Don't know what her mother was thinking with a name like that. But this girl and I, we need to have a discussion. Find her. Bring her here so I can talk to her. One-on-one. -on -one. Do you know where she is? Fuck no. 
If I knew where this bitch was, you think I'd be asking you? Still, there's someone who might. Old Alice McLafferty, Crimson Caravan, might know something. She keeps tabs on caravan traffic in the Mojave. Wouldn't put it past her to keep track of Cassidy Caravans and its owner. Anything you could say to her, you can say... Alright, you know what? I'll do it. Find her, bring her back here so we can talk. Needless to say, there's some good money in it for you. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to stop the video here because I want to sell some equipment and I don't want to run the risk of it corrupting. So, there's quite a lot to do in the Mojave Wasteland of Fallout New Vegas and I'm still doing some jobs here in Freeside, but we're coming to the end of it all. So guys, until next time, I'm Keenan47 aka Wolfkeen. Hope you enjoyed and until next time, bye everybody.